searching for my love, sugar and salt. You know, sometimes when we look at the happiest songs and we read into the lyrics a little bit more, you find out like they're absolutely devastating and tragic. But it's a real beauty. A Mexican cutie. Oh, he's the owner of a successful restaurant chain called Margaritaville. So today I'm going to check out an artist called Jimmy Buffett who I have literally never heard of until I started doing these reaction videos and everybody was like, check out Jimmy Buffett. Who is that? No idea, like literally no point of reference. The song everybody was enthusiastic about is called Margaritaville and I think it's a lyrics only video so we're gonna check that out today. I like jumping into these sometimes when I have absolutely no source of reference. Like. I can't even derive what genre of music Jimmy Buffett is gonna be, cause it's not like the name of a band or something. I don't know why I know it's Jimmy Buffett, not Jimmy Buffet, but here we are. A portion of today's video is brought to you by Magic Spoon. I love tip cereal. A Magic Spoon reinvents your childhood favorites with zero sugar. It also has 13 to 14 grams of protein, four to five grams of net carbs, so that's good if you're carb conscious. It's good for you and it tastes good too, and it has games on the back of the boxes. There are so many flavors so you can mix it up. Guess which one is my favorite? Despite the fun box, it's proper adult oriented because it's high protein, keto friendly, gluten free, grain free, soy free, wheat free, and naturally flavored. It has the great taste that you remember but upgraded with grown up ingredients, nothing artificial. And it has just 140 calories per serving. It's got something you're keeping an eye on. As a cereal enthusiast, knowing Magic Spoon is made with goody good good ingredients and no sugar makes me feel like I'm making a healthy choice without having to actually think about it or do any cooking. Click the link below to try a variety pack today and use code Diane to get $5 off at checkout. Or you can go to magicspoon.com. Slash Diane. Magic Spoon is so confident in their product that they offer you a 100% money back guarantee if you don't like it. Can you beat that? No. So click the link below or use the QR code or the code Diane to get your boxes today and get $5 off. Thank you Magic Spoon for supporting this channel. On with the video. Let's go Jimmy Buffett. Margaritaville. Is it about the cocktail margarita and like how people like drinking margaritas? Could also be about the pizza. We shall see. I feel like it's going to be a happy song. Nibbling on sponge cake Watching the sun bake All of those tourists covered with oil I'm in my six train on my front porch swing. Smell of shrimp there beginning to boil. Wasting away again in Margarita Bay. Searching for my lost sugar salt. But this brand new tattoo But it's a real beauty A Mexican cutie How it got here I haven't a clue Wasting Holiday vibes.
But my heel had to cruise on back home But there's booze in the blender And soon it will render That frozen concoction that helps me hang on Wasting away again in Margaritaville Searching for my lost sugar and salt Some people claim that there's a wall from the blame But I know it's my own damn fault He knows now Interesting choice for a song. Hooray! Today was a day where you didn't try and make me cry with a song. Although sometimes when we look at the happiest songs and we read into the lyrics a little bit more, you find out like they're absolutely devastatingly tragic. Let's find out more about Jimmy Buffett and this margarita song. I bet that's a real party song, like a song you put on at a party and you're like, yeah, everyone knows this song. I wonder if he big in Europe. I don't know. I've never heard of him before, so. Oh, he just died. Oh, that's very sad. Ah. Oh, he was a handsome wee chap, wasn't he? The old tan and baseball cap. Okay, he was American, which might explain why I didn't know him. He was best known for tropical rock music. That is a niche, huh? That is a niche. Like, he found his groove and he was like, this is what I'm gonna do. Other songs include... I don't recognise any of these songs. Cheeseburger in Paradise. Why don't we get drunk? It's five o'clock somewhere. Oh, these are fun songs, I think, until I read into them. Oh, his music across genres, galvanising the music camps at both rock and roll and country when released in 1977. Written in Key West. I was there, I was there. <laughs> Oh, he served in the military, but was diagnosed with a peptic ulcer and freed from military service. Oh, he's the owner of a successful restaurant chain called Margaritaville. It features a tropical themed atmosphere and serves Caribbean inspired cuisine or Caribbean, depending on where you are from in the world. Oh, his fan base are known as Parrot Heads. What? They embrace the laid back lifestyle he promotes through his music and often attend his concerts wearing Hawaiian shirts and lays. I want to get laid. Oh, he's also a licensed pilot. He owns a seaplane called the Hemisphere Dancer. <laughs> he's worth around $600 million. Well, I guess his estate now. What do people do with that much money? Like there becomes a point where you're like, the amount doesn't matter anymore. Do you know what I mean? Like after a few million, I would imagine like, yeah, you'd have to be philanthropic or people would be like, you're a terrible person. He's a degree in journalism. There you are now. Let's learn more about the song itself. On the surface of it, I'm thinking it's a song about margaritas, but when we're going to read into it, we're going to find out it's a song about the shattering realization of the dystopia that war and politics had on the inner turmoil of his young mind or something maybe not though maybe it's just about more for this it is it's a song about getting drunk except the state of mind of being drunk is imagined as a place called margaritaville i like that it's just it is what it says oh he smiled all the time even when he was deeply ill what did he die of oh merkel cell carcinoma cancer gosh darn that empty cancer there you are now, he sounded like a nice fella who just wanted to sing about margaritas. And that's nice today, you didn't make me cry. Yay! Best day ever! That's it for today, see you guys on the inside, bye!